We've got a great video for you today on how to have fun outdoors. That's right, Storyteller Overland. They make the ultimate Overland off-road Class B camper van. Alicia and I are here at the big Florida Super RV show, and we brought our coachman beyond. There's lots of Class Bs, but nothing really like Storytellers Overland. This is one gorgeous vehicle, and we're going to show you the Stealth Mode 2022 versus the Beast Mode. Definitely subscribe to the channel. Check out our Facebook page. Check out our Instagram page. Also, our website, How to Have Fun Outdoors. All kinds of good stuff there. You're going to love this channel. You're going to love the reviews we do. So definitely, if you could, subscribe. It would really mean a lot to us. Hit the like button so more people can learn about Storyteller Overland Class Bs. We took our Class B on the Florida, that's right, Historical Jungle Trail. you got to check out that video recently. How about this global expedition? $700,000 Patagonia. We did that video just a couple of weeks ago from the same show we also checked out overland campers and uh, we looked at black series ember we even took a look at the latest f550 this is the first one ever you're going to want to check out that video super cool just came out we even did overland teardrop campers so we've got a little bit of everything you're going to want to check these videos out they're super cool and if you're into class b's the best of 2022 and you can see right there storytellers on the upper right we've got the five checklists and accessories for your class b we've got winter camping in your class b rv van you're going to want to check that out and one of our most famous uh, videos first 11 uh, days in our first 11 lessons but today is all about the story land uh, storyteller overland stealth mode versus beast mode and we're going to show you these vehicles they are amazing this is one great company really impressed and uh, captain morgan's going to show us through all of this he's one of their local reps and this guy is fantastic and these are some beautiful fit and finish high quality off-road class b so here you go from from Florida. Storyteller Overland is a great company. They produce an amazing product and they really understand their customers' needs and what their customer is looking for in a Class B RV. And that is off road, get out in the woods and do some, uh, you name it, uh, hiking, uh, fishing. Uh, uh, camping in the middle of nowhere. These guys got the models for that. They've got this new mode LT at a great price point. The classic mode, the stealth mode, which is just remarkable, and the beast mode, 198,000. You're going to get to see the stealth and the beast. Pretty impressive overall. But wow, what a great company with great power station. Um, these guys have got a great chassis, great suspension. The tires are just remarkable. Uh, big community following here. A lot of people that are into this Overland uh, Class B's are having a ball. And uh, for sure, Storyteller is doing an amazing job. And you can check them out. They've got uh, their Class B's on display at a bunch of different RV shows. In fact, we were at the Tampa RV Show uh, Super Show back in January of 2022 to check this one out. And we think you're going to love this video. So let's meet with their team and go check out some of their Class B off-road RVs. All right, we got the 2022 4x4. This is the ultimate, and we got Captain Morgan here with the Leche. So can you show us this? Uh, this is a pretty sweet Class B RV right yeah, here. Yeah, it sure is. We call it an adventure van. So the adventure van is a little bit different than an RV because it's multifunctional, multi-purpose. You go off-road and completely off-grid. Okay. Like it. Let's take a look. Show us uh, some of the features inside here. All right. So. Um, you notice uh, when you come in here, uh, you got digital touchscreen, everything. Um, one of the main things that people like is this groove lounge here because it's got a lot of functionality to it. Wow, pretty so cool. This turns into a bed. All right, so now you have sleeping for one here and two more here on the bed back here. Okay. Put this here. Move that up. It's here. And now you have a love seat. Wow. Very nice. easy. The swivel seat, yeah, super easy. You're sleeping for five. Pretty sweet. That's pretty cool. Here. 
the little transformer. Exactly. And now you have drive mode. Seat belts, two uh, three-point harness seat belts. They're pull tested, DOT approved, needs approved, so you can have car seats here. Very nice. Designed to have two full-size car seats. That was both seats swivel around, or they just do. both seats swivel? Around. Okay, so you could have two here, two here, and you're on the Mercedes. This is a diesel. Yep, it's the Sprinter. Okay. Very cool. So obviously you see something here that's you know a little interesting, uh, not something that you see every day in a in a class B RV. Um, but what you're looking at is a shower pan, and this is our Halo shower. Okay. It allows you to minimum uh, instead of taking up 30% of your space for 1% of usage, you can now take up 1% of space for 1% of usage. So that drops down here. Wow! Look at wow. that. Very cool. And now you have a lot more room to move around because you don't have a hard shell right. to create anything. And then when you're done, you leave it here with the fan off for 15 minutes. It's dry. And you... Very cool. Push this in. And then pinch the bottom. Roll it up. That right away, boom, 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 and it's done. Here. Tidiness. Very cool. Now, what do you have for a freshwater tank in this? And we have 21 gallons of fresh water, 24 gray. Okay. Pretty nice. Yeah. And I like done. this design. Yeah. This also doubles as your step to get into your bed. Okay. This is your garage space. Little toy hauler kind of situation. So both, both of these go up, so you can store bikes, you can store, you know, long boards, yeah. sup boards, all that kind of stuff, whatever, whatever, you know, is your fancy. Right behind here <clears throat> is the battery for our Volta system. Okay. It's about this big here. It weighs 200 pounds, um, but it's 12 kilowatts of power. And what that means in, you know, layman's terms is that you can run your AC on high here in Florida for 13, 11 to 13 hours before wow. you need to recharge. That's pretty impressive. Yeah, and the other most impressive part of that is that when you drive or you're at a high idle of 1800 RPMs, you can recharge that whole entire system in an hour and 20 minutes. Very so cool. So it's fast, fast, fast. You got a lot of storage up in here. Okay. Everything's padded. It's super strong. There's no rattles. Okay, very nice. Everything's super tight. Got super your flush. AC here. AC unit. These cabinets are removable. Okay. Um, because we have the height for the garage, some people, some of our customers have said that they're they don't they don't like the the depth here because it's a little claustrophobic for some. Some people don't mind it at all, but yep. we made them removable so that you can. If you want them, you want them. If you don't, you don't. Very got, cool. You know, obviously microwave. You, you have everything. In now, is this regular... just just microwave, yeah, or just is this microwave. too okay? Just microwave. All right. And yep. tucked away here in your top drawer is an induction cooktop. Okay. Nice. Portable, so you can cook here. You can cook outside. Very nice. And uh, yeah, the other thing that I noticed that is really a bit cool about this is actually these uh, extra yeah, table the, that you can have outside. The pop out. Yeah. So you can actually. Even cook or even yeah, outside? Yeah, when I cook uh, breakfast, I cook it outside some bacon and stuff when yeah. I'm not getting anywhere. The sink is here. here. And then a little uh, refrigerator down on the yeah, side. Yeah, that's a cool design coming off this side. Yep. yep. Very cool. Yeah, because you, it, it actually doesn't take space away from uh, the right. inside of the RV. That is very nice. We'll see here. This is our touch screen here. Wow, that's pretty sweet. Yeah. Now, is this got a Truma, or what does it have for heat? How is it's the heat a, set? It's got a Rixon system. Rixon, okay. It's on a dual heat exchanger, so it's going to heat from the engine block first. If that's not hot, warm, then it'll switch over to the S-bar heater. Okay. And you got glycol fluid that goes down and cascades down. You have forced heat from there, uh, and that actually goes by and heats the steel that's surrounding the gray tank. Okay. So you can take that down to negative one. That's how we make this a four-season so it is a true four season off road and it's a four by four, right? Yep. yep. So very cool. So I have a question for yeah. you. Uh, it seems that you have one of this. Yeah. So what is the 
like the most fun or adventurous uh, adventure that you actually had with it? Uh, probably my top two would be I went out to uh, Moab, Utah and spent a week or two down there. Yeah. And uh, we went back down in canyons. I mean, places that you can't get that far because you got to come back to camp. And yeah. I just parked and camped there. Super awesome. And then a couple months ago, I went to San Felipe, Mexico. Yeah. Out on the beach, no resources, but I had an event, so I had everything I needed. It was That's awesome. Absolutely incredible. Fantastic. Well, yeah. we do a lot of skiing too, so this would be yeah. ideal oh, for you know I, uh, win winter camping, right? Exactly. I didn't bring my van up to the mountain before I came here, and I'm in there trying to change in the front seat, and I'm like, man, I hate this. Wish I would have brought yeah. my van. Exactly. <laughs> so if you order one of these, what's the lead time on this? Lead time right now is about a year and a half. If about you, a wow. year and a half. Yep. No kidding. Yeah. But if we give you our name so you can look out for us and there get us go. faster. <laughs> 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 I knew. Alice. And what do we got up here? What is this? This is uh, just a Bluetooth speaker that we that we put in here. Okay. Um, so everyone comes with a Bluetooth speaker. Very good. And you got the vent on the top. And then this is just a drop bug down screens. bug screen. Mm -hmm. From the and back, it separate, yeah, one on the back separates too. on the end um, so that uh, it's a breakaway, so you can keep it down and walk through it and back oh, in. So you don't have to, in and out, yeah, okay, exactly. without opening and closing every yep. time. Mm -hmm. nice, nice, very cool. Yeah. And then, what about these controllers here? What do we got? So, you have a sink drink pump, it'll make a noise, okay, and that takes the water down and puts it in the gray tank, okay. Um, you got a hot water circ button, so you circulate your water so that when you turn it on, it's hot right away, so you're not wasting water because you only have 21 gallons in a van. Uh, and then you have cargo lights back here. Okay. That's cool. Very cool. And then all the different drawers coming yep. up. Yep. Yep. All the different drawers. And, you know, just one thing that we do uh, is quality. Wow. So okay. these aren't thin quarter-inch plywood. This is real, real ducktail deal. and super easy yeah. to use. You just push those in. Nice. Just like that. Uh, nice we like that. Easy. Quiet Very closed drawers. Cool. And where do you manufacture these? We manufacture these in Birmingham, Alabama. In Birmingham, Alabama. Yep. And how old is the company? Tell us a little bit about the company and yeah. how do we get a hold of you if we want to buy one of these? Yeah, so uh, we've been in business for, we're going on close to five years now. Uh, we were talking about it the other day, we're like, man, can you believe it's been three years? And then we add up, no, it's, it's, al it's almost been five. <laughs> um, so, you know, the company found, we found that there was a, a missing part of the market. Um, in, in the adventure van space and the overlanding and you know ma mainly everything's your traditional rv type thing right. um, so we wanted to create something that's multifunctional. you can have you know you can bring a small family you can live in it full time if you want to uh you can use it on the weekend you can just pretty much go anywhere and so that's how the the passion started uh, and then we got um together with the uh, you know like-minded people who we're actually in the custom world of, of uh, upfitting and everything, and so super high quality. Um, and then we have you know more passionate people on the dealer side, so that we know uh, what was missing in the market as far as how to treat people, how to treat dealers. That's how we came up with the invoice pricing, so every single person pays the same price That's all nice. across the country, no matter Very what. I cool. like that. Yeah. Like yeah. That. Yeah, because it's uh, so, and then service. Service is one of the things that are that are difficult. So we're we're doing things to try to change that as well. That's awesome. Mm -hmm. All right, and then finally, the warranty on this. How does how does that look? So the warranty from Storyteller is one year, fifteen thousand. Okay. Um, the Mercedes is your your standard three year, thirty six, and five year, hundred thousand. Um, but but different, you know, parts of it have different warranties. The microwave is a different warranty. The right. Um, the AC has a different warranty, but. We're gonna ask you to call us, and we're gonna have you submit your forms and stuff, and we're gonna go about and take care of you know what needs to be taken care of. And this unit here, what's the model number and the pricing? This, this is a 2022. Yeah, this is a 20, 2022 stealth mode. Okay. And it is 169 uh, 454. And how many we feet? Have, uh, it's 19 and a half feet it's on the 144 chassis. Okay. Um, we have uh, four models, so we have a, a Ford Transit uh, oh, chassis, you do? and that's okay. called the Mode yeah. LT. And then we have a uh, mode 4x4, and then we have the stealth mode, and we have a beast mode. Okay, very cool. Yeah. Real sharp. What is your favorite? 
Uh, I go back and forth all the time between the stealth mode and the beast mode. All right. So we are in one of the favorites. Yeah. So it must be the good one. Yes. <laughs> all right. Well, I think we covered everything here. Let's take a look at the outside. How about, do you have some outlets here? I see two. Yeah. We didn't talk about that. So, so you've we got have, the USB. We have the USB and we also have um, port for 110. So you don't have to, you, you don't have to run the inverter all the time to, okay. to run the power there. Very cool. All right, let's step on out and take a look at the outside. All right. Yeah, real nice paint job, real cool design, nice wheels for yeah, sure. Yeah, so the stealth mode is, you know, the reason it's stealthy, right? It's not your your traditional looking, you know, camper and all yeah. that. We black out the wheels, we put a wrap on the bottom, so it's streamlined. You still get the storyteller look, but it's a lot more subtle. Um, we black out the emblems on the back, we wrap the hood, um, we put this invader rack that we make here. Okay. Um, so basically an accessory carrier. You can get E track and X tracks, and you can mount it um, whatever you need to. You know, storage boxes, for bikes, spare tire, whatever. bikes, yeah, um, anything you need, so that you're maximizing your space inside. Um, Very cool. Those soon will be available on the website, just our website as well. Okay. And you have that also on the Ford chassis. No, this is this will be specific just to the stealth. Okay, it is just to the stealth. Yeah, these okay. are some of the things we try to separate the models. Um, okay. To be the most value add for each one. Okay. okay. Um, you get 360 cameras, um, lane assist, park assist, uh, um, uh, wind wind assist, all all the top Mercedes um, safety features, the high the high stuff. So you got. Luminous uh, roof or side ladder here. Yeah, that's really nice. It's connected to the chassis and to the the roof rails so that it's uh, super super strong. You get front runner roof racks so you can put storage up there. You can get up there and watch a uh, sunset. You know, have breakfast. Um, it's actual usable. Uh, wow. most, and do you have any use, solar up there or no? Yeah, we do. We have 100 watts of solar. 100 they watts have, of solar. Solar panel. Okay. Um, and you'll know, use the smart plug so it's it's uh gets you 100 percent efficiency um when you're doing it's uh it's locked in there it's not rattling around and losing connection mm -hmm. um, and this is a super cool feature here uh we created we put this on here uh because Very of nice. a lot of the fires that were happening and hurricanes and people losing power um so this is a 27 amp output power okay so you can power your house if you go out of out of power so you can turn your lights and heat on um, or you can power someone else's rv for a small period of time if they're with you and and they happen to run out of power i like that right. you're a we, safer we got it covered <laughs> um, that yeah. is awesome so very very nice you guys did a great job on this this is the stealth mode four by four yeah, what do you think behind. aliche what do you want to give this one well, obviously, five discovery buses. They <laughs> thought about everything in the shower, like uh, the saving space, uh, a lot of bedding, uh, so a lot of people that can actually travel with you with yeah. no issues, uh, a lot of flexibility with uh, the sofa and uh, becoming a bed and uh, all the different seats. I uh, like uh, even uh, the kitchen, uh, even small like that, uh, you have everything you need uh, from the cooktop to the uh, to the space uh, to actually have uh, your meal, and uh, it's really nice. Yeah, we love our Class B, but the one limitation is for sure the off-road 4x4. And we do the fishing, the winter camping, everything, and it would be so sweet to have some of this capability, right? Yeah, so yeah, you definitely. can kind of go wherever you want to go. And uh, we live up in New Hampshire, okay, so yeah. this thing would be the bomb up there for yeah. sure. <laughs> yeah, one thing that I really enjoy is uh, actually the top there, where yeah. you can actually see it and use it. Yes. Yeah. It would be nice to actually use this ladder and check it out. <laughs> Very cool. Yep, yep. Well, thanks so much. We really appreciate your time. Yes. And uh, we'll get this out on YouTube and everyone can check it out. Yep. And uh, Liche, what do you got to say to everyone back home? Well, I really hope that you guys enjoy this video. Please don't forget to subscribe, hit the like button, and uh, thank you for watching uh, our out. video on how to have fun outdoors. outdoors. All right. <laughs> Captain Morgan! <laughs>
All right, look at this. This thing's the beast. You got suspension, you got, uh, bigger tires. Um, and the clearance on this is how much? 13 inches. 13 inches yep. versus the stealth the clearance? Stealth's at 10 inches. 10 clearance. inches. So this is the big dog here, right? It sure is. This is, this is wow. the one you get when you go way out. When you need ground clearance, you're doing a lot of technical four-wheel drive, off-roading. Um, all are capable, but this just is a little more capable. Yeah. And, uh, go for it. Yeah. Sorry, I also noticed the lights on top there. Yes. They are pretty awesome. Yeah, so you got 360 lights all the way around the beast uh, so that when you're out in the dark, you know, four-wheel driving, you turn those on, it's like daylight around you. You can see everything so you can see your approach and, and where you're going, what you need to do. Comes with a spare tire that matches these on the back of the door so that if you do find yourself in a situation, uh, you can change that real quick and keep going instead of stopping your whole trip and having to go get a different tire. Wow, super cool. The, the interiors of the beast, uh, the capabilities, the power, all that's exactly the same as all models. Okay. But the beast has exterior upgrades to have it so that you can basically get out in Overland right from the, from the dealership floor. Very, awesome. very cool. Now, how much is uh, a 2022 Storyteller Overland Beast that is go gonna, for? That is going to be 198743 Okay, yeah. right on the dime. Look at that. Yes. This is perfect for when we are going to travel in Africa. Go see the big five, right? Absolutely. We're going back. And the interior is exactly the same? Yep, interiors are all the same. Exactly the same. So it's all about the outside. Yep. and uh, it's all about what flavor you like. Wow, very, very cool. All right, well, there you have it. You got to decide now if you're going to go with the Beast or the Stealth. So. I'm sorry, but I get the Beast and I go in Africa. <laughs> there you go. All right, sounds good. The Beast is a beast. This is one amazing Class B RV. And as you can see here, it is the ultimate Class B for off-roading. They have done it all, 13-inch Ground clearance, total 4x4, four four, just amazing design, ladders, lights, huge wheels, and on the interior, lots of good uh, you know, features and benefits. For sure, check out that 3200-watt inverter. That's pretty impressive. 21-gallon fresh tank, 24-gallon gray water tank. And, uh, you know, eight inside 110 outlets, three 12-volt power ports. Uh, it's got a little bit of everything, as you can see there. Um, truly a great product. I mean, everything about it is just beefy and quality, and, you know, they, they just go out of their way. And what was really impressive out of all the RVs we were looking at at this Tampa show was their control system. 11-inch full-color touchscreen control system. Uh, was ex extremely impressive. The exterior, we've already showed it to you. It's on the Sprinter Mercedes 4x4 144 chassis. And uh, this thing is uh, got it all, right? I mean, it's, it's definitely set up to be an off-road vehicle. And uh, the power stations, that uh, output is pretty cool the way it's set up. And uh, overall, what a great product. And as you can see here, um, you definitely want to check out their website with all of the information uh, on this. And here's a, another overview outlook of the actual van itself and how uh, it is its little own transformer as it uh, can convert into a lot of different uh, design features inside for, you know, if you want to have it be a little toy hauler and carry your electric e-bikes, uh, kayaks, you name it, it's all set to go. But overall, we love this product, and uh, we think uh, you would definitely be impressed if you saw this um, in real life or at a dealership. Well, we hope you enjoyed this video, the 2022 Storyteller Overland Off-Road Class B Camper Van RVs are truly amazing. Great fit and finish, super quality, lots of innovation, which I really love to see. Um, great ground clearance. If you're ready to uh, get out there and do some outback camping, fishing on some remote rivers, uh, any type of overland activity, this would be our recommendation for a Class B off-road vehicle. It is awesome. We really appreciated 
all the people with the organization, super friendly. Uh, they've got a great product and uh, we think that uh, if you did purchase one, you would be super happy. So thanks so much. Please subscribe, hit the like button. It would really mean a lot to us. Help us grow this channel and uh, thank you so much for watching. How to have fun outdoors.